Okay, so I'm going to start a little... I started a new, uh, well, I used an old account from FICS that I'm not particularly using. I'm going to start trying to raise it up. And I use to play three minute games, I guess. And I'm going to go play a ten minute game. And let's see where I'm at on FICS, because FICS has more serious players. It can be easier for me to develop as a player. And it's actually a good way to see myself progress with these videos. I'm going to, like, video record myself. Not every single game, but... A game every once in a while, you know, just to check up on my abilities. I want to challenge this guy, but, you know, I don't want to challenge 800s. Wait, where's my... Oh, I had a certain rating there. I'm going to go 1,200 minimum. And then anybody else can, <coughs> anybody else and their mother can, can play me. Okay, so I'm playing Big Man, third, twelve, thirty, thirteen. So I'm gonna go play E4, gain some central space right off the bat. Scandinavian. Let's do this. If it's exchange variation, I'll just press D4 instead. Nope, just we got a regular Scandinavian. Okay, and now I'm gonna go ahead and Fincetta. Let me Fincetta. Just because I can also gain tempo with this development, technically. Mm -hmm. I expected that response for. I have two, you have two, let's see what you got. Okay, he got queen activity and I got development in. So let's see that. I don't know what this is pretty much for. It's King's Hot Castle, I can try to take advantage of that. <coughs> and, what else is there? I think I'm... Oh, I need to get my queen out of there. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna go here. And there. Uh, just to get my bishop out. The tempo. Maybe I don't want to get it here, because this is a bothersome square with my bishop. My bishop wants to be here, attacking this. Oh, and also he's attacking if I go here. Hmm. <clears throat> it's really enticing me to do this, so I'm gonna go ahead and push. I think I want it here. If I go here, I can bring it over here. So if I go in knight d5, I can challenge the queen. Queen probably gonna go in knight d or queen d6, and I can move my knight somewhere else. Uh, first I'm going to gain some control over here, and then I can do it. So bishop here, he can have that pawn, and then I can do this. My pieces are developed, and therefore I must attack as quickly as possible. And the best way to do that is to have a queen on an open file, or a semi-open file, capturing your pawn and your rooks being able to develop and attack. So this game could become a little devastating for him. It might be a little devastating for me, just because of, uh, the, <clears throat> the, just because of the, what's it called? The pawn majority. He has more pawns than me. Now I can check, he can go over, he can bring over. So I'm just going to bring up my knight before it goes dead. <laughs> what's he challenging over here? He didn't challenge anything. If I take here, he takes here, and I can move my queen out. I want my queen somewhere there. So try to bring my queen in. I need to get rid of that knight, though. This looks like a nice centralized square for my knight, too. So I'm going to go ahead and lead it here. I mean, let me have that little post. So how can I take advantage of that? Well, first, let's check him. Let's pick up the knight. And resignation. Okay, that was a quick game. And let's have a little five minute game real fast, just because... I feel like I... Whoa, that was quick. Uh, I'll play... Sicilian? Let's try Sicilian. Just because I've read, like, a little bit about it, and it... Go... Here, 
He offers the exchange. I'll take right here. And then let's go here. A little dragon variation. And he's going Yugoslav attack, that little mark right there. Okay. Nice little trips and tricks here. And the second I castle, you reach a critical position. Because if a bishop goes here, if he brings his queen up, and then his bishop goes here, his bishop is going there. Okay. So if I take, he takes. If I can take here, you can take with pawn. <clears throat> so let me castle first before I think of anything else. Mm -hmm. Okay, queen rolling over here. And now I'm going to be here. And I'm going to tell him to think twice before castling. That's my little message to him. Move my queen over here. And now I can stop the attack here because if he pushes here this is going to be very scary for me <coughs> hmm. if I push here you can push here and I can capture capture and then it leads to one pawn so I'm going to go ahead and do this <coughs> and then try to gain counter play by going over here going here and what else is there Okay, he recognizes that. So he's going to go ahead and try to pull off that pawn push. I can go ahead and bring my queen here. Just because it gives my queen access to this square here, which I want it on. It's a multi purpose move. I don't have to worry about that because I'm still going to attack her and defend her. So I'm going to go ahead and pawn push here, pawn push, capture, capture. And now if he can't. Well, we almost didn't want to look at this. If I capture here, hmm, maybe I have like a little bit of tricks up my sleeve right now. I don't want to do that. Maybe this works. I didn't analyze deeply, nor do I want to analyze deeply, just because it's a five minute game and I just realized that. And now let's send my pawn rolling. <clears throat> and I think our attack, our attacks are equal, in as far as how much we got uh, done. Okay, I'll gladly give up my dark square bishop for now. Hmm. So he's bringing his queen in. It looks a bit intimidating, but. I think I can just pull it off, because I can just bring here, he has a pawn push, I can push it, and break it open, right? Only problem is that I need, I need some sort of counter attack. How do I get a counter attack? Because right now he's planning to do this, capture, capture. And I have no defense for that. What if I go here? If I go here, his queen has to back up. I'm getting defensive. Okay, I have to stop reacting to my opponent's threats. Come over here. And create my own. <clears throat> so queen side, I have open file here. So if I take... If I double up, he has to push. Reacting to me. And then I can push this pawn eventually. So I'm going to go ahead and do this. So pawn push, I already analyzed that. I have to. I have two methods of doing that. If he takes here, he has to take with knight. I'm gonna take here with rook. He takes with pawn. I take. I go up here. I want to take with rook, and he goes right there, and he goes right. I go right here. He has to move there. I'll check again. He has to move somewhere else. Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I'm not. Let's try this. <laughs> maybe I'm crazy. Okay, now he wants me to react to that, so I'm reacting to that because I have to. Not that I'm scared, but I have to. <laughs> Little race position, this is razor sharp if I ever make a mistake. I probably already made a mistake, 
And if I already make a mistake in tempo, then I'm pretty much screwed, but I'm going to have to try. Okay, so I see an attack, I just analyzed that. That was my moment of silence for analyzation. I see a small attack, nothing too big, but... It might give me a little edge. It might give me a little edge. My king has these little escape squares around here. The board of the board. Now if I take, he takes a knight, I take, check. He has to move these two squares. He moves here, I capture, check. He has to move. If he moves here, I capture, have another threat. So I believe this is the right move. Nothing too far analyzed, just there, you know? Hopefully I didn't mess up. <laughs> hmm. Maybe? I don't know if that drops it. <laughs> Does that drop it? Cross your fingers. Doesn't drop it. Okay. Uh, let me analyze that before I do it. Check. He has to move out of the way. Let's say he moves here because he has to move there. Mm, do I have any counterplay after that? I think I'm just going to move back. Am I okay with that? Am I okay with moving back? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. <laughs> And then I can get rid of this bishop because it's it it offends me. The bishop offends me. Oh! Oh! Whoa! 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 I wasn't gonna drop something. No, I wasn't gonna drop something. I'm running low on time. I'm running low on time. I can't. Oh! I just made it myself. No! No! <laughs> Oh, that was like a tongue biter. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, that's the end of this video for now. <laughs> oh,